Hi guys. So Rowan, um, I'm sorry for the bad camera quality. Um, I got a new computer but I haven't figured out how to adjust the webcam yet. So um yeah. Some towel not at work. I am recording from home. Um, it seems to be pretty quiet right now, but I don't trust that it'll stay that way. So uh, I'm really sorry about that. Also, I have no idea what the quality of cam is going to be like, what the quality of video is going to be like, because I am recording directly to the tube. Um, again, I haven't figured out this webcam yet. So, um, I have no idea how to record using software from the webcam. So I thought this was the only way that I could do this. Um, in this video is the email alpha tag. I was tagged a couple of weeks ago, but I haven't been able to make the video because it's just been too noisy here, and I haven't been able to find a quiet moment to get to the library or something and record there. So I'm doing the female alpha tag now. Unfortunately, I can't remember who tagged me. Um, it's on Facebook. If you go on my Facebook or I'm on the whisper. Um, you'll find it if you tag me, and if I remember, I'll put it in the description box later. So, one of the rules is you have to have your hair up, but as you can see, my hair is very short, <laughs> so I, um, I couldn't do that part, but anyway, we'll get to Question one. The questions are over here if you're wondering why I'm not looking at Favorite clothes brand? I... Hmm, I tend to wear a lot of Joe Fresh, um, but I find a lot of their clothes are made for really waist thin women, and I'm not a waist thin woman. <laughs> so, uh, I, I'm choosy, but I generally like their clothes, whether I like them on me or on other people. Question two, favorite drink or cocktail? I actually don't like liquor. <laughs> I just find the hard liquor just nasty. Um, if I drink any kind of alcohol, um, yeah, no, I really don't drink. So, um, yeah, my favorite drink, not an alcoholic, would probably be chocolate milk or my fun milk, which I have right here. Yeah. Favorite chick flick or romance movie? I actually don't like those either. <laughs> I don't watch movies, so I fall asleep. Um, I know Pride and Prejudice put me to sleep really nicely. So I guess that'd be my favorite as a sleep aid. Four. Favorite older actress. My older, you mean what, 30 plus? Um, uh, and I don't watch movies, so I really don't know. I guess Meryl Streep. Why not? She seems to do well. And favorite younger actress, question five, is... I have no idea. I'm going to go with Emma Watson just because I recently kind of stole her hair. It's grown out now, but I stole her hair for a while. Um, six, favorite type of workout or exercise? Well, I have um, a messed up knee, so I can't do a lot of cardio exercises, so I've recently been really getting into the elliptical or cross trainer. And uh, I do that a lot, so I guess I'd go with that one, although I really like working machines at the university gym too. Number seven is triple question mark in brackets, your choice. I have no clue what that means. I, I choose confusion. <laughs> Number eight. Badass or nice guy? Well, I married the nice guy, so I've got to go with nice guy. Nine. Favorite moisturizer? I have rhinoceros skin. I can do anything to it. I, I So, because of this, I don't take as good a care of it as I probably should. And you can rant and rail on me all you like for that. Um, I do have one moisturizer that a friend got me for Christmas. Um, it's not for face, it's for um, legs. It's like a body moisturizer. And it is, um, I can't see it from here. Um, it's like a, it has a very Asian scent to it, and it came with a, a, a basket of products. It's from a body shop. 
and it, it's something about a, a Japanese bathhouse. I can't remember. <laughs> Maybe someone will recognize that from my really bad description, but that's probably my favorite moisturizer. I really like how it smells. Ten songs or girl boxers. Girl boxers. Eleven, dancing or singing? Well, I'm gonna say singing because I sing much more regularly than I dance. Twelve, shoes or bags? Neither. Um, shoes because I have two different size feet, so it costs me double to get whatever shoes I want. And, um, bags? Um, I just use my backpack for almost everything. Favorite book, apart from the good book. Uh, I really like the author Guy Gabriel K. Oh, Guy Gabriel K. Probably I can't remember how he says it, but um, I have all his books and I really enjoy them. Fourteen favorite genre of music. Let's see. Well, I listen to a lot of metal. Um, but I'm picky when it comes to my metal. I don't like just anything. Um, I grew up listening to a lot of classic rock. And most classic rock is okay. I mean, unless it's just really cheesy, then even I can't handle it. But, um, I don't know if I specifically have a favorite. Most anything within the rock and or metal genre, I'm okay with. Yeah. Fifteen. Dream proposal or dream date? Um, I really don't know. I have no idea. I never really wanted a big proposal. To me, that's just unnecessary. <laughs> Same thing, I always used to tell my husband um, that I didn't want an engagement ring, I wanted an engagement dishwasher. I couldn't lose it, <laughs> and it would be useful. <laughs> so I'm not big on, on that kind of thing. For me, a, a dream date is coming home after class and finding supper ready, which I get a lot of the time. Cause I'm very fortunate. <laughs> I'm very good at this. So that would be my dream date, having supper made and the dishes done. Oh, that's, that's exciting when the dishes are done. Sixteen. Arms or abs? I don't like muscular men. I really don't. I find too much muscle makes unattractive to me. I understand that a lot of women are really attracted to that, and I understand the utility of being a strong man. Um, I just, I, I don't really like either. I, I guess if I really had to pick, I would go ab, just because core muscle and strength is important for your health. But, yeah, not a big muscle person. 17. Jake Gyllenhaal or Ryan Gosling? I have to say Jake Gyllenhaal. I had a huge crush on him when I was in the school. 18. Favorite scent on a guy? I like the smell of a campfire, which is really weird, maybe, to some people, but I really like the smell of a campfire. But if they're talking about, um, they're talking about, like, brand deodorant, that kind of thing. I would say it's like, is it? 19, steak or fish? Fish, because last night I had a bad steak experience where I chewed, but I chewed, and I chewed, and I just could not chew this steak. So, I have, I have, this is the end of many experiences like this. I've had this steak, so I have to go fish. 20, pants or skirts? Definitely pants. I'm, I'm one of those people who, doesn't think about how they fit. <laughs> so with a skirt, if I'm wearing a skirt or a dress, I always have to be very conscious of how I'm fitting and that creates extra stress. So I try to avoid that. 21. Mascara or eyeliner? Um, I actually really almost never wear makeup. It's very rare. This is the first video I'm actually wearing mascara. So uh, I guess I'll have to go with mascara. 22. Hair straighteners or hairspray? I actually don't own any hairspray, but I do own a hair straightener for a bath and hair long, so I guess we'll have to go with the straightener. 23. Blusher or lipstick? I don't ever wear either, unless it's forced on me. Um, 
So, but I guess because I play flute and other few other wind instruments, and I do singing, I find if I have lipstick on, it really or even lip gloss, it really messes with my ability to play the wind instrument. So uh, I guess if I have to pick, even though I don't wear either one, I would go with blusher. Twenty-four heels are flat. As I said, I have really messed up feet and screwy knees, so I have to go with flats because heels, I'm just a walking wreck in heels. 25. Winter or summer? That's really hard because I'm, I'm a really, I don't know what I'm doing in Canada really, I, I can't stand the cold. But that being said, winter, I get a real vacation. During the summer, I have to work because I know in some European countries they pay for your university, but in Canada we we don't have our university paid for, so I always have to work to earn enough money to afford school the next year. So, um, but winter vacation, I I do actually take off my Christmas vacation, so uh, I don't think I can choose between the two. One, I have vacation; the other, I'm not cold. Twenty six. American football or European football? Definitely European football. I don't watch any sports, but if I have to watch a sport, like if my husband's watching or something, I would definitely take European football over American. I, the subtleties of American football are lost. 27. Favorite hair product? Shampoo. I don't use hair products. Just, yeah. Occasionally use some pomade, I think it's called, but very, very rarely. Just shampoo and conditioner for me. A simple lady. Floral sweet or musk? I actually don't wear perfume, and I've noticed this about, <laughs> I don't know if it's just specifically where I am in Canada on the East Coast, but perfume is really frowned upon here. There's a lot of people with perfume sensitivity. And most places, it's considered courtesy not to wear a perfume. And it's like I said, very frowned upon to wear perfume where I am. So I, it's never something I buy. It's never something I have on hand. And uh, my own mom actually goes into a really bad attack. I'm not attack, but she's really sensitive to perfumes. So I don't own them and I don't wear scented products. So yeah, neither. None of the above. 29. It's a Friday night. What are you doing? Sleeping. Because Friday night, or excuse me, Saturday mornings are the only mornings I don't have to get up for anything. So Fridays, I just go to bed and enjoy my sleeping time. 30. Favorite type of coffee? I hate coffee. Oh, I cannot stand coffee. <laughs> awful, awful brew. Um, occasionally I'll drink tea, but even then, I don't like a lot of caffeinated beverages, I don't like pop either. So, um, yeah, that is the last question, apparently. So, um, I guess I'm not much of a female alpha, because most of these <laughs> I couldn't answer, or I answered really badly. So, um, hopefully this turned out, hopefully there's no issues with the sound quality or the, um, the video quality, although I know I'm looking at this is not so great, but hopefully you'll all survive. And um, I am planning to do some videos about my trip to the Netherlands, or at least one video. And the Fairyland one is still in the works. I've got certain parts done, but I have to put it all together. So until next time, yeah.